Let's look at today's function, transpose. You may need to switch or rotate cells. To do this, copy and paste the transpose option and use it. However, this creates duplicate data. If you don't need it, you can use the transpose function instead to enter the formula. For example, in the following image, the formula equals transpose A1, B4, gets cells A1 to B4 and arranges them horizontally. If you're using the latest version of Microsoft 365, you can type the formula in the upper left cell of the output pane and press enter to verify that the formula is a dynamic array formula. Otherwise, you need to enter the formula as a legacy array formula by first selecting the output range, entering the formula in the upper left cell of the output range. And then pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter to confirm. Excel inserts curly braces at the beginning and end of the formula. Step 1. Select a blank cell. First, select some blank cells. However, be sure to select as many cells as the original set of cells. However, select in the opposite direction. For example, here are 8 cells arranged vertically. Step 2, type equals transpose. With a blank cell still selected, type equals transpose. Excel looks like this. Notice that 8 cells are still selected when you start typing the formula. Step 3, enter the range of the original cells. Then enter the range of cells you want to transpose. In this example, the cells are transposed from A1 to B4. Therefore, the formula in this example is equals transpose A1, B4, however, do not press enter yet. Please stop typing and proceed to the next step. Excel looks like this. Step 4, finally, press Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter. Then press Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter. Why? This is because the transpose function is only used in array formulas, which is how to complete an array formula. In other words, an array formula is a formula that applies to multiple cells. Since you selected multiple cells in step 1, you selected them, the formula applies to multiple cells. The result after pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter is Useful tip There is no need to manually enter the range. Equals transpose, you can use the mouse to select the area after typing. Just click and drag from the beginning to the end of the area, but when you're done, press Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter instead of just the Enter key. Try using the Copy, Paste, and Transpose options. However, Keep in mind that this creates duplicates. Therefore, if the original cell changes, the copy will not be updated. The transpose function returns the vertical range of cells as the horizontal range. The reverse is also true. The transpose function must be entered as an array formula in a range that has as many rows or columns as there are columns in the source range. Use transpose to move the vertical and horizontal alignment of an array or range on a worksheet. 